Hey guys, I'm Danny, your friendly neighborhood colorist, and in this video, I'm going to give you my take on what I like and dislike about the Hanser Pro. If you don't know what the Hanser is, basically, it's a plugin for DaVinci Resolve, Premiere Pro, After Effects, and Final Cut Pro to easily create film print emulation. Some of the effects include film print profiles, film compression, Kodak 2383, and Fujifilm 3513 print film grain, gloom, halation, gate weave, film breath, and more. With that said, let's start off with some of the downsides of the Hanser. The first point I want to make is that the Hanser might not be for you. Most of its functions is catered to someone who wants to emulate film and have a very organic look to their footage. This includes imperfections while shooting on film like film grain, gate weave, blooming and such. So if you are mostly doing commercial with clean looks, the Hanser is practically useless for your type of work. Next, the Hanser is not foolproof. There are quite a number of toggles that you have to know what you're doing to use. Assuming that most of us haven't really shot on film before, it could get pretty intimidating to see all the settings. So don't expect to know everything the first time you are using the Hanser. But luckily, that's a lot of YouTube videos teaching you how to use it and you can even check out my walkthrough video link below. Lastly, being its price, the Hanser is not cheap. The Pro version comes in at $399 and $199 for the light version. They definitely sit in a more premium price compared to other digital products out there. Moving on to what I really like about the Hanser, Although the Hanser comes at a hefty price, I would say that it emulates film quite amazingly. I could have 63 film profiles in my arsenal without thinking too much. So the Hanser has pretty much done all the heavy lifting when it comes to emulating film stocks. When you're doing color grading professionally like myself, you come to appreciate the tools like this that will give you more convenience in terms of building looks. The Hanser Pro offers accurate film emulations. Instead of doing the emulations myself and guessing what it looks like on my footage their team has analyzed dozens of real photographic and motion picture film you can check out their blog post on how they build the film profiles in their website if you're into that kind of stuff on top of that with the addition of effects like gate weave and film breath it makes your footage look more believable like it was shot on film before this it was harder to fake imperfections while scanning film and it's the little details that adds to the believability so all in all i really love using the hanser pro and i'm definitely Definitely planning to use it on music videos and also some feature films that I'm grading this year. So if you want to get the Hanser Pro for yourself, use my discount code DANNYGUN for 10% off on your purchase for any product by the Hanser. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!